So we saw and this is Kulela really Bureau TV. My name is Julius Howard. Of course, we're still in conversation with uh, the Zola Bank Manager, of course, who's applying all available options in making sure that bank services are extended across Lofa County. As a young man, actually, he's um, like uh, struggling seriously, and profusely, he's pressing all buttons in making sure that bank services are extended across Lofa County. But is banking and banking services still a serious challenge to the people of Lofa County? Is what he's come to address. So, uh, Mr. Oba, welcome back thank you and uh, i want to apologize to our audience for the break in technology yeah uh these uh issues uh that occur everywhere in liberia mm. um, and uh where we are is no exception to that okay uh, like i was saying uh when we came uh october 10 2015 mm. up to 2016 we started paying gios salary and what have you we were solely and wholly depending on uh, GOS salary payment in uh, in terms of revenue generation. Okay. But uh, at the time when the when the civil servants decided to switch to mobile money, okay. Like I said, it's also good because uh, it's good to live also in a capitalist society mm. where in criminality would not be that as huge as it is today. Okay. Um, after that, the, 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 the many of them switched to mobile money. Mm. Our next question was, how do we survive in the midst of uh, our uh, uh, dependable customers have switched to mobile money? We no longer uh, be earning revenue from uh, remittances and what have you. Okay. So the questions came, can we start engaging our various communities, uh, the business owners, uh, can we start engaging them? I think that questions we we follow it up, and those questions were answered. We started engaging other business entity. I mean, they start seeing reasons that they so, can. So, what was the result? The result was good. Okay. And uh, we we move on with that. And uh, in, I mean, for any financial institution, there are major pillars. Okay. For 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 any financial institution. Okay. And that one pillow. Uh, is the 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 the, the loan uh, uh, the, the 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 extensions of credits to 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 invest a possible investor and uh, uh, business entities. Okay. And that's where we 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 switch. Okay. And when we switch there, it, it begin a a shiny stars for a begin a shiny stars for for our institution. Okay. Based on the fact that. People didn't know that we can be we we are capable enough to extend hands uh, to other business entity. Okay. But when we started that, mm. I mean, uh, it became a light. So we, we 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 are so we are actually so concerned about the kind of challenges people were faced with during the time of Echo Bank in this place where you used to see we, the bank flow there that is, people and, 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 and trying to get that is that is that is yeah that is huge yeah and uh, I I remember a story. Uh, of a teacher from Salai, yeah, who went to Vonjama for his salary, mm. and uh, he was there. Yeah, he left his family, and without thinking mm. that you know he was sick, he didn't feel ill. Yeah, but when he came, he was standing in that song, he mm. felt up and died in the process. Okay, I mean, those were. Uh, 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 Challenging stories. Those it's were it's those were crowdedness of of, yes. of, of of bank still be experienced in Lofa County, especially mm -hmm. around the Zola Bank. Uh, right now, right now, mm -hmm. right now, right now, we we don't experience that because uh, in in Lofa, Lofa uh, as a whole, and I want to be grateful to the people of Lofa County, mm -hmm. the 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 all of our shareholders across Lofa County. Okay. Lofa have been one of the counties, with the exception of Nima, mm. Lofa have been one of the counties that have three RCFI. Okay. That means Lofa and Nima has six. Out of the 12 RCFI, mm. Lofa and Nima has six. So that that is the kind of thing Lofa County is doing. Okay. And it is all, all was because of these uh, uh, challenges our people face mm. uh, uh, back in the days uh, leading so some dying in the process. Okay. You know, those were reason why these RSCFI, these financial institutions came. Okay. But further, mm. it is not it is not easy to 
to move from point to point as you can see now yeah. i'm not i'm not in 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 in, in in cold place, yeah. I'm not sitting now. Air condition blowing me. Yeah, you in the And field. it is just simple. Okay. If you want to get to the people, you need to live and walk to the people. That's how business. That's what business call for. Okay. You can't be sitting now and the business come to you. You have to move to the people, get to them, make them to understand that you are ready for it. Okay. If you don't move to them, mm. if people feel that you are joking. Okay, so that so is the reason why we are moving to them. Let me ask you one simple question, but in the first place, please make your presence felt here by giving us some thumbs up, uh, give us some quick reactions from there. Like uh, Juje Wonwe, he says he's following us from Modrovia, that's the nation's capital. All of you that are following us, please notify us that you are following our followers, our regular followers. You can comment if you like. Yes, no problem. We read out your comments. But uh, this is an exclusive conversation with uh, the manager of the Zola bank of course the issue of banking is still uh, a problem in some parts of lofa because you said the mobile money the issue of mobile money is playing some role in uh, some of the challenges that the the regular banking system is but uh, as it stands right now because um, lofa county is a kind of county where you have too many people employed uh, in government in the uh, in the employed of government let's put it that way but uh the issue of getting that money some people will have to leave from here go to uh, uh nimba go to bong county and other places and what are you doing in making sure that some of those things are laid to rest yeah there there are several things we there are several uh measures we have put into place we we not just going to 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 send the move to mobile money yeah and we we fear that at all costs yeah. even even if you should, they, they, I should we should all serve them yeah we have to bring the mobile money services to the bank to, them, to the bank okay you got your mobile money you come we cash it up okay. we cash we do cash up for you mm -hmm. unfortunately for lofa mm -hmm. lofa is not a cash in economy yeah it's mostly cash out economy okay wherein people only receive cash and they don't send cash okay that's become another challenge okay because sometimes you you somebody will come uh with hundred thousand for instance okay. the one to the one to cash out you expect somebody to come and send if not hundred thousand maybe fifty thousand so mm. that it can help you to remit the one the hundred thousand you have cash out but it's not actually like uh, like that okay unless other county like grand grand crew for instance mm. grand crew uh is more like cash in society because you got more business people in grand crew mm. that is sent for goods in morovia unless lofa mm. lofa people can live from here easily and travel to morovia to get their goods okay so basically mm. the the way the, the only thing cash out here mm. Uh, uh, more mm. than cash. Okay, so uh, we understand the, the, that your the next extension. One, we the ne the, let me just yeah. uh, 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 get to this. Yeah. We also observe that uh, you Echo Bank was in Lofa. Mm -hmm. Echo Bank present in Lofa. Mm. It has a call. I mean, it started serving Lofa the entire country. Okay. So the departure of Echo Bank from Lofa, we also uh, uh, saw it as a challenge for our people. How? Uh, uh, for the fact that mm. many of them were were having accounts with with Echo Bank. Okay. Okay. Mm. So when Echo Bank was living, Echo Bank uh, uh, brought in a digital platform mm -hmm. where the express service. Yeah. Okay. So when that platform came, we also managed to have gotten that platform so that I mean at all level our people can be safe at all level. Okay. And the the whole thing about it, the mm. issue of RCFR coming to this places mm. i don't think it's actually it's only squarely profit maximization right mm. it's also to save the people worrying onto the fact that in past time our people have suffered so go and save them that is the reason why you will see this rcf has survived because it is owned by the people okay. that the people themselves controlling it all right so thank you so much and um we understand that you are extending some uh services in other parts of the county and quite recently we understand that the branch was open in salai do you care to tell us how that came about and who are the brains behind that thank you um i want to be grateful to all of our shareholders i want to be grateful to the the local government officials i want to be grateful to the government 
of the Republic of Liberia for providing us the enabling environments to do our business. Mm. Um, the issue of salary came about uh, when we saw the need. Okay. For instance, people in salary normally I go to salary. Mm -hmm. I we do marketing in salary back and forth, back and forth. People, somebody will tell you, say they want to save. Maybe they have something like three thousand dollars. They want to save. Mm -hmm. They want to save in their account. Mm -hmm. They want to save every week three thousand dollars. Okay. Looking at transportation from salary to Zozo is like seven hundred. To mm -hmm. go and come will be will cost them one thousand four hundred. So that person will not see the need to come and deposit, but rather keep the money home. What if criminal enter on them? Mm -hmm. That person suffer. So we have experienced these things and what I view. So that is the reason why we decided opening an outlet in Salai. Okay. To also send, of course, our intent, our main goal mm -hmm. is to serve our people at across all level. Mm -hmm. We decided moving to Salai and 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 offer our uh, little services there mm. so that salary too can be uh, uh, can be a benefactor to this process. Okay. You agree with me that the, the name RCFR Zola mm. is not Zozo alone, mm -hmm. it is also citizen of Zozo, Zozo and Salai. Yeah. So combined citizen of Zozo and Salai make up Zola. So the, the institution is squarely owned by citizen of Zozo and Salai district. Okay, thank you so much. And we have Yankwe Vetra Molba, who's uh, also following us from Odrovia, and he has a question. He says, my question is, what's the credibility of the community bank? Do you care to address that? Uh, it's simple. The credibility is just simple. Okay. If we, we were not credible, we are, like I said, we have operated seven years. Mm. If there was no credibility, we are closed. You... Take a look at the two of RCFI. Okay. For the matter of fact, I know about all of the RCFI in this in this country. The, we have twelve, and all of the twelve, Lofa has three. And more than twelve, I chair the the twelve RCFI. So I have I am knowledgeable of all of the RCFI in the country. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So credibility is there. Human being, we are not hundred percent right, mm. but credibility is. Our hog mark. Okay. Dave Kesley is watching from Minnesota. That's Count Rapids. And he says that's very sad of our county for uh, the bank services. Uh, of course, it should be happy now because bank services are being extended uh, through the influence of this very young bank manager. And so I don't think if that's a sad event, I mean, issue anyway. So thanks very much for joining us from Minnesota. And uh, for those of you following, we said give us some thumbs up so that uh, Facebook gets to know that we are busy right here. And we are in a very exclusive conversation with the, um, the, young, uh, the youngest bank manager in fact across low fast we've seen so far uh, Jackson Walba and uh, he's very busy in the field as you can see from the background he's been busy and um, making way uh, that the bank, bank and banking services are established and um, provided for people across the county so we ask you this one last question if you would have any question from our followers and then we conclude um, what actually is your intent uh, do we actually understand a clear definition of your intent of extending the services across the county is it only to serve the people or there is a different intent uh that is the basic first and foremost intent mm. to serve the people mm -hmm. and make the financial institutions sustainable. Okay. Today, I might go, but let the financial institution serve the people mm. perpetually. And you know, in time past, mm -hmm. people have said, more especially where we we come from zozo okay people have said oh they have said a lot of things they have did a lot of things together before mm. and then material lands okay this should work manos plus jackson woloba who is now the manager manos plus him mm. this should survive and okay. it will survive yeah. so the, the 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 real intent on this is to serve the people to serve the people Thank you so much, manager, for speaking with us on Today Liberia TV. Of course, um, is there anything that you'd like to tell your people in the struggle? Um, what I have to say is I want to be grateful to the people of Zozo 
salary ye lofa country okay for affording all the opportunity to serve and uh, in my mind we will not have showing our what it, what is in us if the opportunity was not provided okay and those who provided the opportunity are our people i want to be grateful to you okay i want to be very much grateful to you and i want to call on all citizens of lofa county now uno zozo now uno salai see these rcfis as a promising institution for growth mm. for economic growth for our people i remember people are uh, uh, many of the people we have served many of them got houses they got their own property they got this one i mean it is the 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 coming of the rcfi look don't see this RCFI. Don't see them in the manager. Don't see them in the management team. Don't see them in the 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 entire management team that inclusive of the board and the management. See the RCFI. See the citizen of Lofa County within the RCFI. Be your own security for this RCFI. Be your security. The survivability of this RCFR today depends on we as citizens of Lofa County. Let no one think that it is only the management team, but it is all of us because we are all benefiting one way or the other. And trust me, this is going to work. And I want to say to, to our partner who have been working with us so tirelessly, I want to be very much grateful to them. I want to be grateful to the, 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 the government of the Republic of Liberia through the, the Central Bank of Liberia who provided the opportunity, who, who, who set the platform for this RCFR to be established. I want to be grateful to Central Bank and the government of Liberia. I think this, this financial institution can help to drive the economic growth of this country. That is no doubt about that. I believe in it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And to you, Yankui Veteran, sorry, we are speaking business right now and not politics, so I will not ask this your political question. And I hope to reserve this for the next time. And we're just spoken with the manager, the bank manager for Zozo and Salary District, qualified as the Zolai Bank, serving financial and financial-related services, providing financial and financial-related services across the county. Thanks so much for speaking with us, Mr. Manager, and we hope to get to you next time. Thank um, you. The opportunity is available. Thank you. Thank this you. is Today Liberia. My name is Julius Howard. It's a privilege, and we want to say thank you. And this is our we conclude this exclusive interview with Mr. Justin Wollaba.